today God will do great things. So God will do great things. In your life, God will do great things. So God will do great things. God will touch your life. God will bless your life for connecting to join in today's prayer. Hey, I am praying for somebody who that your joining to this prayer will not be a waste of time in the, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Mm. Just get ready. One thing I always tell people in the, in, the, in the midst of prayer is this. Have faith in God. And today, because today is a prayer of warfare, we are going to war, wrestle with principalities and powers. When we begin to start now, you will see the hand of God in your life. But let me say this. As we want to pray, God demands our utmost attention. Whatever we are doing, we should give God that regard. Stay with him, be with him. You know, when we have a conversation with the president, we give the, give president, the president the utmost attention. attention. All that he needs, all that he demands, we give it to the president. Why? Because we know this person is of a higher authority. Now we are coming to God, who is of the highest authority. I want you to give God the utmost attention. We shouldn't be praying, and we are doing one thing or the other. We should concentrate on God. That's how we, do, how we respect God how we regard him, how we honor him, this, we now make God to know that this time, every 2 p.m., Nigerian time, and 8 o'clock, American time, is our appointment time with God. That this time is a time that has been set aside for God and for God alone. And that's why today, I don't want you to have any doubt in your heart. I don't want you to have any doubt in your mind that God is going to touch you. Sister, God will touch you. My brother, God will touch you. All the desires of your heart, the Lord will give to you. Just believe the Lord. Trust the Lord. As we begin to pray now, have faith in God. Have faith in God. Hey, God want me to tell somebody. He said, before we finish now, before we finish this prayer, before we finish this prayer, the hand of God will reach you. The hand of God will touch you. Amen. The hand of God will do your own in the name of Jesus. Let's have a word of prayer. Yes, 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 yes. Our Father and our God, we return all the glory unto you. Known unto you are all your works from the foundations of the earth. Father, we come before you. You are the you are God, the God that answers prayer. prayer. The Bible, Bible says, say, say, unto you shall all flesh come. And Lord, we have come to you today because we believe that you are all things are possible. Father, we come before Jesus. The Bible tells you, Shabbat, and that every tongue shall confess that Jesus is Lord. Oh God, we have come to the prayer room. We have come to the upper room, the room of power, the room of prayer, the room of authority. Oh, Lord, as we begin to knock the door of heaven, I pray, Lord, that anything whatsoever that can stand on our way, oh, God, to our miracle, I pray that the blood of Jesus will flush it out, will blot it out, will take it away in Jesus' name. Amen. My Father, my God, Father, unto you shall all flesh come. We have come unto you, O God. Father, I pray, no one, O God, online today will be disappointed in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Heavenly mm. Father. We return, we return all the glory, glory unto you. In, in Jesus', Jesus name, name, we have prayed. Amen. Beloved, today is not, not last right. week. Today is not last week. Today is different. And and God will be leading us. The way God leads us, please follow the leading. Though I told you when we started that when we begin to pray, there should be no diverted attention. Don't be your attention should not be on, on, on other things. Concentrate on God because I know God will do something in your life before we finish this, this prayer. 
We are going to sing a song. I'm going to sing it for about five minutes. I told you that today is not last week. The way God will be leading us today, wherever you are, just concentrate on God. Just believe the Lord. Don't doubt God today. Today, you will see instantaneous miracle. Whatever be your heart desire, my Bible tells me that the desire of the righteous shall be granted. As long as you are a righteous man, you are a holy man, a holy woman, a child of God, my Bible tells me that your desire today, it will be granted in Jesus' name. We are taking this song as we, be, as we begin to pray. We want to start the prayer now. I have no other God but you. 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 Oh, I have no other God but you. I have no other God but you. Father, I have no other God but you. I have no other God but you. Jesus, I have no other God but you. Father, I have no other God but you. I have no, I have no other God but you. I have no, I have no, I have no other I have no other God but you. I have no, I have no other God but you. I have no, I have no other God but you. I have no 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 other God but you. I have no other God but you. I am no God but I
Those who are so big, are so big, are so big, they don't even know what to do. They don't even know what to do. That you have prayed and prayed and prayed about. That I need you. Today is that day. Today is that day. God is going to do Let's read our things today. Let's read our our text. In the book of uh, Ephesians. Ephesians chapter 6. We want to read. Let me read from verse 10. We want to read. Let me read from verse 10. He said, finally. He said, finally. My brethren. brethren, Be strong. Be strong in the Lord. In the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God. That you may be able that to, may be able to stand the walls of the, the walls of the devil. So we wrestle not. So we wrestle not against flesh and blood. Against flesh and blood. But against principalities, but against principalities and against, and against power. powers. Against, against the rulers of the darkness of this world. Of this world. Against, against spiritual against wickedness in high places. We are for. Take unto, take unto you the whole armor of God, that you may, that you may be able to stand, to stand, to stand in the, in the evil, evil day, day, and having and done having all, all to stand. To stand. Beloved, Beloved, we are, we are in a war battle. battle. Battle will continue, will continue until we see God face, face to face. God face to face. And our battle to differ. We have spiritual battles. We have physical battles. Some battles, some battles are from our origin. Why some battles are the one we have we have caused for ourselves. But whatever the battle is, the good thing about it, it is this: no battle is greater than what God can handle. I want, to tell, I want to tell somebody listening to me. God impressed upon my heart to tell you. He said that the battle that you are carrying. He said the battle that is going, said the battle on, in that is going on in your life. He said the rehandle that battle. He said the rehandle that battle. He said the rehandle that battle. He said the rehandle that battle for you. He rehandle your battle. He rehandle the battle. He rehandle the battle. We are going to call upon God. We are going to call upon God. So before we pray. Before we the Bible pray, says, finally, my the Bible brethren. says, finally, my brethren, before you, in this battle, before you can join you must be in this battle, God. you must be your a child of God. Your sins must have been forgiven. You must have any load of the devil you must have have any load of the devil in your heart. The devil must not be having a, a, the devil must not be having a, a controversy with you. The devil must not be pointing accusing the devil must not be pointing accusing finger at because you. Because of the small sin in your because life. Because of the small sin in your because life. Because of the big sin in your because life. Because of the big sin in your you life. Know, most time we pray, we you don't know, see answer. Most time we pray, we don't see. Do you know why? Do you know why? It is not because it is not because, it is because, because of sin. It is because of sin. The Bible says it by regard the iniquity in my heart. The Lord will not hear me. The Lord will not hear me. If you regard iniquity, if you regard iniquity in your heart, the Lord will not hear you. And you know today we want to. And you know today we want to fight. We want to fight of faith. We want to fight against the mountain. We want to fight against the mountain. Against the very problem of your problem. Against the very problem of your problem. I am praying for somebody. I am praying for somebody. I pray for the source, the origin, the beginning of the battle. Where your battle originated from. I pray that the battle of your battle will dry up. Jesus name. Hey, get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. We are going to the we are going to the root the root of your battle the root of your battle the root of your problem the root of your problem the source of your problem the source of your problem, of your problem. Whatever, whatever it is known or whatever it is known or no the way you know the way you don't know the way you don't know we are going to the very origin of, the very origin of that battle. origin of that battle and God must set to that battle for you set to that battle for you beloved beloved we don't have much Time. We don't have much time. Do you know what I know about God? God is great. God is great. God is great. God is great. There is nothing. There is nothing. He cannot do. He cannot do. I may we I may we know certain words. I may we know certain words. 
There is nothing you cannot do. There is nothing you cannot do. Jesus Christ, the Son of God. Begin to thank God. Begin to thank God. Begin to bless the name of the Lord. Begin to bless the name of the Lord. Begin to bless the name of the Lord. Open your mouth. Begin to bless the name of the Lord. Open your mouth and begin to thank Him. Begin to worship Him because He's a great God. He's the God that is not in the world. He will not have put money out of the mouth of the Lord. He will not have put out of the mouth of the Lord. Today. 
Amen. 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 Please, I raise the prayer now. Maybe you didn't hear me. You didn't hear me. I'm going to miss the two prayer now. God is telling me that somebody, somebody, your life was nailed. They nailed your life. They nailed it. They nailed your health. They nailed your child. They, they nailed your daughter. They nailed it to the rock. They nailed it somewhere. You are going to pray. Anywhere, any shrine where your life has been nailed, that the fire of spiritual capital, I, I command anywhere, any place in my life has been nailed. In the name of Jesus. Oh, we enter there and scatter it. It's called the letter of abuse you. That letter, they bring out the letter. They bring out your past mistake and they are using that against you. They bring out your past life, your past error, and they are using it against you. You are going to call upon God. And the letter of accusation that is being raised against me, against my family, against my daughter, against my son, against my life, against anything that belongs to me. Oh God, let me catch fire. Prayer. Pray, 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 pray. We are, we are, let Receive fire. Oh, yeah, receive fire. Receive fire. That's shrine. That's shrine. Where your name is being mentioned for evil. Oh, yeah. Let the fire of God come down there. Oh, yeah. Born by fire. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let the fire of God. Fire, 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 fire. Fire of God. Fire of God. That letter of accusation. Be born by fire. Be born by fire. Be born by fire. Be born by fire. Oh, yeah. Born by fire. Oh, yeah. Born by fire. That's shrine. Oh, yeah. Be consumed. Be consumed. Be consumed. Be consumed. In the name of Jesus. Oh, God. Every wicked elder, every wicked man, every wicked woman who has gathered to destroy me, every activity of which every power of darkness, every principalities and power, the one in my house, the one in my family, the one in my village, whoever they are, whoever they have gathered together against me, against my family. If this brother is not praying, no. This brother is not praying, no. We have few minutes to go. We have few minutes to go. Who put the water fire the prayer? Who put the water fire the prayer? Who told you? Who told you not be set free? Who put the water call upon God? I told you today is not last week, oh. Today is not last week, oh. Open your mouth and pray. Say to your kids before God. Open your mouth. Hey, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen, 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 amen. Listen to this. Listen to this. Listen, listen, listen. Listen to this. God just impressed upon my heart now. Hey, you want to answer my thunder. In Jesus' name, we pray. Fire, fire. Amen. Listen to me. You are going to pray. You will talk to the Lord. Oh, God. Every problem in my life. My life. The one I know, the one I don't have. The problem I know about 
The one you know, the one you don't know. You know, oh my my eh, open your mouth and pray. Blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus. Swallow my problem. Swallow my mountain. In the name of Jesus. Swallow, 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 swallow. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Swallow up every mountain in my life. Lord of Jesus, swallow every mountain, every problem, every sickness. Oh, yeah, swallow every delay, every obstacle. Oh, yeah, swallow every poverty. Oh, yeah, swallow every lack. Swallow every challenge, every sickness, every arrow. Swallow it in the name of Jesus. Swallow, swallow, swallow in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name. We pray. I am praying for somebody. Amen. I am praying for somebody as I am led. I am praying for you. If you have amen. a believing, amen. amen. I am praying for you. Amen. I am praying for you. Amen. The origin of your challenge, the origin, the beginning, the source of your problem. Mm -hmm. Whether it started many, many years ago, whether it started now, whenever, wherever, whenever it starts, whatever dates, I am praying that your problem, the source of your problem, the beginning of your problem, the The roots of your problem, wherever it is. Oh, Jesus. The one in your family, the, the one in the village, the one in the city, the one in the water, the one in the tree, oh, the one in the bottle, anywhere Jesus. it is. I am in the name of God, so in the name of the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I seal all our miracles with the blood Hallelujah. of Jesus. All the, all the prayer. Hallelujah. Amen. The God answer everything now and grant the request now. No, nothing will delay the answer. Every prince of partial in the air, I bind you and I command. Let the answer mm. come to that brother, come to that sister, sister, in the name of the father, mm. brother, in the name of the father. Oh yeah, the son of the Holy Ghost. Receive the answer to your prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Thank you, Father, for answering prayer. Over Amen. to you, Pastor Mother. Let's call upon the name of the Lord. Let's call upon the name of the Lord. Let's pray for Pastor that by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, the spirits of the Lord will continue to abide in him. Let's open our mouth. Amen. Let's pray for open your mouth. Let God let's upon the, the spirit of the Lord, Lord will continue to abide. Let let thank God. We have not seen nothing. Until it will be over. For the judge, for the old God, for the family, let the Almighty God have we have seen nothing. For all what we have done today is done in the beginning. We give you glory. Let's call upon the name of the Lord. We give you glory. We give you glory. Hey, my Father, we give you glory. The mighty hand of the Lord. Father, receive all the glory. We will continue to walk in the spirit of the Lord. We will continue. To grow in the Lord, 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 the Amen. 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 Pastor Mike, 
uh, and I saw the grace in him. It was like, I, if he could remember, I decided that we should have another program entirely for him. But the man is very, very humble. Uh, he doesn't care. He surrender even the Saturday pro program to the pastor therefore. He doesn't care that, oh, this is what the pastor Matthew have said. This is my plan. This is what God has. He totally surrendered the program to pastor therefore. And then we can still even see the way he led today. Let's call upon the name of the Lord. He has humbled himself before Almighty God. Almighty God will continue to promote him in Jesus' name. Let's open Amen. our mouth. Let's call upon the name of the Lord. That by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, in ministry in the house, in the church all over the world, that by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, Almighty God will continue to promote him in the name of Jesus Christ. His ministry will be expanded. His ministry will go beyond the church.
burning, if you keep on 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 burning, in the name of Jesus, oh Lord, I pray, you will sustain us in this group, oh God, you will hold us together, you will unite us, you will unite us, you will unite us, you will unite us, amen. Pray for all our donors, those people who have been supporting us online for this program, that by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, God will continue to empower them financially, physically, socially, and in, the, and in their family too, in the name of Jesus Christ. Let's open our mind. Let's pray for all those who have been donating for God in order to sponsor this program. That by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, Almighty God will continue to provide for them. The Lord will continue to provide for them. That we come before you, O God, we pray. That how God surprised them. That okay, a person visit, visited a, a, a governor, and then the, the the governor, the man was the man was asking the governor, "What should I do for you?" Then the governor took the person to a church and said, "You see this church? Whatever you want to do for me, I want you to do it for them." That's how the the man roofed their church. And then he cover it with ceiling, and he surprised them with a lot of things. We pray for the church. I'm saying it. The church will all. I don't know one of our participants is in that church. I don't know the, the church that is. Yeah, but the power in the blood of Jesus Christ. Yes, the way I'm saying the church is that's not been completed. We will call upon the name of the Lord. That by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, God is going to provide for them in Jesus' name. And that by the power and the blood, the church Amen. will be in the standard of the that we glorify the name of the Lord in Jesus' name. You see, you see, Bagara, you see how Amen. people are people, you see a lot of things that we do. We will call upon the name of the Lord. Our God surprised the Pan Bible Church in Bagada. This church, the pastor is with us now. If the church is just coming, I will see it and it, it will flash away. Let's call upon the name of the Lord. That financially, God is going to help them in Jesus' name. Spiritually, Amen. God is going to help Amen. them in Jesus' name. And by the Amen. power in the blood of Jesus, the church is there to spread the, the good news. God will use the church multiply in that environment in Jesus' name. Let's pray for the church. Let's pray for their pastor. Amen. That by the power in the blood of Jesus, that by the power God is we bring to God the church before you. That by the power bring the name of Jesus. 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 You told me we will supply all our needs. According to your will, we know that Christ Jesus. Who go will pray for this church in particular? Father, we pray for all the desire, O God, of this church. Lord, grant it in Jesus' name. Mighty Father, we pray that Lord, by your grace and by your mercy, O God, you will grant the desire of this church. You will fulfill this church. You will settle this church. You will establish this church. In the name of Jesus, O God, I pray that this church will stand. This church will not fall. This church will not crumble. In the name of Jesus, all the needs of this church, both spiritual, both physical, and financial, O God, I pray, you will supply. You will supply. You will supply. You will supply. In the name of Jesus. Amen. for yourself today. And as you are praying for yourself, I'm praying for myself. That by the power in the blood of Jesus, there have been always say people, some people are aid. But one thing is that if the head is there, if there's no pillar, the head will fall. You will call upon you the name of the Lord. Father, 
make me a pillar to build many churches. There's nothing God cannot do. Do not offer and uh, underestimate yourself. God will use you. God will use me. Amen. Call upon the name of the Lord. Father, Amen. I surrender myself for the growth of the churches in Nigeria, for the growth of the churches, for the growth of the word of the Lord, for the growth of the faith of the continents. Call upon the name of the Lord. Father, use me as you are doing all that you are doing. To build the church, oh my Father, use me in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth, call upon the name of the Lord. That Almighty Father, I surrender myself as you are doing all that you are doing. I surrender myself as you are doing. Let us pray. Oh God, you laid this prayer in my heart as I want to pray now. Lord, I am praying. I pray for this, my brother. I pray for this, my sister. I pray for this, my pastor. I pray for this, my pastor. Oh Lord God of heaven, I pray by your mighty hand, God. Oh, this my brother. Oh, this my sister. Oh, this my pastor. No, no, first we fall in Jesus' name. Amen. I pray, Lord, you will hold us in everything. Financially, Amen. you will hold us. No, no, first we lack. Father, Amen. Amen. those that serve you, they will not lack any good thing. I pray, Father, we will not lack. 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 In the economy of Nigeria and the world, we will not lack. Jesus, we will not lack. Oh God, I pray, supply the need of every brother, supply the need of every sister. We will have abundance to give out and to help others in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Let's share the grace together. We shall meet on gathering of the eagle tomorrow by the grace of the Lord. Let's share the grace together. In the grace the of grace our Lord, the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us and forever. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us. All the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of God forever. Forever. Amen. Thank you. God bless you. We we'll see you tomorrow. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Is Abraham when he was called to go out into a place which he should after receive an inheritance obeyed and he went out not knowing whither he went he was called to go out by faith he went out Go out, he went out by faith. Second Corinthians chapter 6, verse 17. Second Corinthians chapter 6, verse 17. Wherefore, come out from among them, and be ye separate, says the Lord, and touch not the unclean thing, and I will receive you. The same commandment comes to us. Wherefore, come out from among the drunkards, from among the gangs, come out. From among the association, association of sinners, of deceivers, come out from among them, among the occultic, Come out from among them, among the worldly wise. Come out, 
touch not the unclean sin, and I will receive you. And the face that has evidence and experience will be the faith that makes it to come out immediately like Abraham did. I will be a father unto you, and ye shall be my sons and my daughters, says the Lord Almighty. I pray your faith will produce action. I said your faith will produce action. And the evidence of faith will not be missing your life in Jesus' name. We're coming to Hebrews chapter 11, verse 17. Hebrews 11, verse 17. By faith, Abraham, when he was tried, offered up Isaac. And he that had received the promises offered up his only begotten son. Understand here, by faith, the most precious thing he had, the most precious commodity he could lay claim to, and the most precious possession is Isaac. The Lord tried him and said, offer up Isaac. And we're told he offered him up unto God. His only begotten son, of whom it was said that in I seek shall thy seed be called, accounting that God was able to raise him up from the dead, even from the dead, from whence also he received him in a figure. He offered up his Isaac and he received him back. It's by faith we offer to the Lord. And what we offer to the Lord will receive back in multiplied folds in Jesus' name. First Kings chapter 17. By faith you give it up. By faith you offer it. And it is that kind of faith that has expression, that does exploits. First Kings chapter 17, verse 8. And the word of the Lord came unto him, saying, Arise, get thee to Zarephath, where belongeth to Zidon, and dwell there. Behold, I've commanded the widow woman there to sustain thee. So he arose, he had faith. A widow woman is going to sustain me. What about that? He arose. A widow woman I've never met, I've never seen, you've commanded him, what's her name? He has not given the name, and so he arose, that's faith, that's faith, and he went to Zarephath. And when he came to the gate of the city, behold, the widow woman was there gathering of sticks, and he called to her and said, fetch me, I pray thee, a little water, in a vessel that I may drink. And the widow woman did not say, I'm at the end of my provision. And you're asking me for water? Look at what God has done for me. Look at the situation in which I am. Look at my predicament. No, people of faith don't complain. People of faith demonstrate their faith. And as she was going to fetch it, he called to her and said, Bring me, I pray thee, a morsel of bread in thine hand. And she said, As the Lord thy God liveth, I have not a cake, but an handful of meal in a barrel, and a little oil in a cruise. And behold, I am gathering two sticks that I may go in and dress it for me and for my son, that we may eat it, tell me, but you will not die. I say you will not die. It appears there's no work, no sustenance, 
no help, no hope, no bank account, and yet the Lord is asking you, even the little in your hand, offer that I seek unto me by faith. Faith works, and faith obeys, and faith does something. And Elijah said unto her, fear not, and the Lord is saying to you today, fear not. Fear not, go and do as thou hast said, but make me thereof a little cake first, and bring it unto me, after make for thee and for thy son. For thus says the Lord God of Israel, the barrel of meal shall not waste, neither the cruise of oil fail in your family, in your life, until the day that the Lord sendeth rain upon the land. How do you know that the woman actually believed by doing what the prophet had said. Look at it now in verse 15. And she went, like Abraham, and she went and did according to the sin of Elijah. And she and he and her house did each many days. The promise of God will be yes and amen in your life. But you know, we need to have practical faith the faith that works. The faith that will not look at the littleness of what I have, and then I cannot be faithful, I cannot have faith. I cannot give anything to God anymore. Abraham gave by faith. This woman gave by faith. You will give by faith. And your cup will not run dry. Your barrel will not run dry. And the barrel of meal wasted not, neither did the cruise of oil fail according to the word of the Lord, which is speak by Elijah. The word of God will work in your life. Second Chronicles chapter 20. Second Chronicles chapter 20, verse 3. And Jehoshaphat feared and set himself to seek the Lord and proclaim the fast throughout all Judah. Look at verse 12. In verse 12 it says, O our God, what wilt thou not judge them? For we have no might against this great company that cometh against us, neither do we know what to do, but our eyes are upon thee. Your eyes are upon the Lord. Even when you do not have anything to show for it, believe God, the Lord will turn the situation around in Jesus' name. Look at verse 20. And they rose early in the morning, and they went forth into the wilderness of Tekoa, and as they went, Jehoshaphat stood and said, Hear me, O Judah, and ye inhabitants of Jerusalem, believe in the Lord your God. They were fearful. Believe in the Lord your God. They didn't know what to do. Believe in the word of the Lord your God. And the enemy outnumbered them. Believe in the Lord your God. So shall ye be established. You are established in Jesus' name. Believe also in his prophets, and so shall ye prosper. Somebody there is going to prosper. You will prosper in Jesus' name. Believe everything will be all right. Now, they were fearful before, they have been told now, believe. What's going to be the response to that word, believe? It's like they were sorrowful. 
They could have been crying. They could have been staying, saying, life is coming to an end. But now they are told, believe. When you believe, what are you going to do? Verse 21. And when they had consulted with the people, consulted with the people, do you believe? Yes, I believe. Do you believe? Yes, I believe. How do we show our faith? How do we demonstrate our faith? We were fearful before, but now we believe. We were sorrowful before, now we believe. And they consulted. What are we going to do? And it says, the appointed singers unto the Lord. You must do something that shows that you are believing. And that they shall praise the beauty of holiness. The problem was still there. Should praise the beauty of his holiness. The enemies were still there, and the war was still there. The battle was still there, and the enemies still had their weapons in their hands. And they were ready to shoot, and they were ready to destroy Jehoshaphat and the people of Judah. And yet they said, we have believed because the Lord has given us the word. And they did something that showed they were believing that shall praise the beauty of holiness as they went out before the army and to say, praise the Lord for his mercy endureth forever. Praise the Lord for his mercy endureth until this day. Praise the Lord for his mercy extends endureth until tomorrow. Praise the Lord for his mercy will endure until the end of your life. Praise the Lord for his mercy endureth forever. And when they began to sing as the evidence of their faith, when they began to sing and to praise as to the practical faith they demonstrated, the Lord sent ambushments against the children of Ammon. The enemies are defeated. And Moab, they are all gone. And of Mount Seir, which were come against Judah. And they were smitten. And they are smitten. And they are destroyed. For the children of Ammon and Moab stood up against the inhabitants of Mount Seir to utterly slay and to destroy them. And when they had made an end of the inhabitants of Seir, every one of those your enemies held to destroy themselves, destroy one another. Their arrows will not touch you. Their spears will not touch you. Their magic will not come near your doorstep. And their messengers of death will never know the address of your house but they will destroy one another. And when Judah came toward the watchtower in the wilderness, they looked unto the multitude, and behold,